This week's unsung hero is Mifflin Gibbs. Mifflin went to work at age eight, as his family, though free, was poor. He had a hard work ethic. Mifflin was certainly a doer. Swirling all around him, issues of race revolved. Reading and observing, that's how Mifflin evolved. He heard of an opportunity, an invite up the coast, black migration to Victoria, then a remote outpost. Gibbs got his things in order and to Canada he located. In this frontier community, a new life for him awaited. Gibbs helped build the foundation of the modern day West Coast. He built BC's first railroad, innovating more than most. Active in politics, in his community respected, Mifflin was one of the first black officials then elected. But what Gibbs is most renowned for, where his legacy was coined, was negotiating terms for BC and Canada to join. When Canada wasn't formed yet into one connected nation, Mifflin made his mark as a father of confederation. In the 19th century, the governor of Vancouver Island encouraged people to settle there. Mifflin moved to Canada from California alongside several hundred other black people. He became successful in the real estate business. He was also active in politics and encouraged the black community to vote. In 1866, Mifflin became the first black person elected to public office in British Columbia. Though Mifflin Gibbs died a wealthy and influential person, even in the Jim Crow era, he did little to preserve or publicize his achievements. Even his autobiography, while reliable, leaves a large part of his life unaccounted for. Though he lived in British Columbia for a little more than a decade, he managed to leave a significant impression. His political activism ensured that colonial administrators kept their promise to enfranchise black settlers in British Columbia. By organizing a coalition of black voters and later gaining a seat in Victoria City Council, he helped give his community a voice in local government and access to important power structures. In 2016, the city of Victoria declared the 19th of November Mifflin Gibbs Day in honor of Gibbs becoming the first black person elected to public office in British Columbia. In 2017, Gibbs was recognized as a person of national historic significance by Parks Canada and honored with a bronze plaque. So there you have it, this week's unsung hero, Mifflin Gibbs.